Hello everybody, today we are just going to be doing a cleaning of this CRKT fossil. This is a full-size fossil, model number 5470. This is going to be up for sale on my eBay account. It probably won't be there very long. It should be going for about 35 if I'm not mistaken. Please do check that out. That does not include shipping. 35 is roughly half of what these go for brand new, and this one is basically brand new other than the uh, no box. Not a big deal to me, but if that's a big deal to you, I'm sorry. We're going to do a mild cleaning because I don't want to take this thing apart. It's in really good condition other than a little bit of dust on the inside. <clears throat> so to clean this, we're going to use isopropyl alcohol. 70% from the dollar store. Super cheap. Makes things nice and easy. And a Q-tip that probably got from CVS set of 600 or something for like five bucks. I don't know, it's been a while. See, that's why we clean these. Anything to keep these things clean for the next owner. It is in great condition other than all the dust. Oh yeah, there we go. Anything else? Nope, don't see anything else. Okay, next on the list, a drop of oil right there. That will help make this smoother. That is only for the ball bearing on the liner lock right here. It does make things a lot smoother. Now this thing is on ball bearings. We will clean up here a little bit. Now, sure, let's go ahead and take that apart. We have a T8. I believe it is a T8. Hip. There we go. I've never taken one of these things apart, so I'm gonna get a good look real quick. I was only going to take this apart to spread it a little bit so that I can get a tiny bit of oil there on the bearings. Okay. Next, we will put this back in, and we will recenter it the way that it was. Centering is something that I tend to care about, makes a knife look good. Okay. Oh yeah, that thing rockets out like it's assisted now. Heck yeah. For such a big blade, it is a little bit surprising. We will go ahead and clean up the excess. The oil I use is food safe. It is mineral oil. I wouldn't be too super worried about anything. There will be a little bit of excess showing up right here. It will go away as you open it and clean it. Do not be surprised by that. It does have a completely factory edge with a tiny bit of glinting right here in the recurve. That right there. 
it's kind of hard to see, but it is there. Other than that, um, I don't see any blemishes or anything on this thing. It is immaculate. It is a little bit dirty from me cleaning it, putting my hands on it and stuff. We will go ahead and clean that off real quick. This thing will be up for sale again on my eBay. It will be linked down below. First come, first serve. Lower 48 only. I cannot afford international shipping and I do not want to do the customs forms for sending a 4 inch blade knife out to another country. This is a 4 inch recurve drop point. Overall pretty comfortable. But yeah, it should be $35 plus shipping. Shipping is going to be around 10. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great rest of your day and we will see you in the next one.